Why is coenzyme Q10 so important for energy production in the body? We need to go back to biology. Okay, so we know that energy is created in mitochondria, in cells. When we burn a fuel source, like glucose for instance, we need to grab those high energy electrons and transfer them to the inside the mitochondria where they can join something called the electron transport chain which is in the inner membrane of the mitochondria. Now before we can transfer the glucose electrons to the mitochondria we first need to convert that glucose into pyruvate then acetocoenzyme A and it's that acetocoenzyme A which joins the citric acid cycle in the matrix of the mitochondria. Now, the citric acid cycle strips the acetylcoenzyme A of high energy electrons, and these high energy electrons join the electron transport chains by joining protein complex one and protein complex two. These are proteins which are embedded in the inner membrane. So when the high energy electrons join protein complex 1 and protein complex 2. They need coenzyme Q10 to ferry the electrons from these two complexes to the third protein complex embedded in the inner membrane. The rope is up. Now, if there was a deficiency of coenzyme Q10, then electrons will build up in these complexes and eventually leak out where they will prematurely combine with oxygen to form free radicals which can then damage these membranes and these cells they can eventually lead to disease now, now once the coenzyme Q10 has transported the electrons to protein complex 3 they're then transported to protein complex 4 via cytochrome C where at the right time and place they combine with oxygen to produce water. Now, because we're moving high energy electrons, we use that energy to push these hydrogen ions from the inside of the mitochondria to the inner membrane space. So, as we're, the electron transport chain is shuttling electrons from protein complex to protein complex, at the same time it's pushing protons in this inner membrane space. After a period of time, we get a massive concentration of hydrogen ions or protons in this inner membrane space, and they're able to flow down their concentration gradient, and literally they turn a small turbine called ATP synthase, which is used to produce ATP. Think about a hydroelectric dam where water flows down a mountain, turns a turbine to produce electricity. We do exactly the same thing in the body, but instead of water, we are using the flow of protons or hydrogen ions and we're producing ATP, adenosine triphosphate, which is the energy currency of the body. So now you know why coenzyme Q10 is vitally important for energy production in the cell. So to summarize, it basically ferries high energy electrons from protein complex one, protein complex two to protein complex three. If it wasn't there, we would get a leakage of electrons where they would combine prematurely with oxygen to produce free radicals damage the cell and cause disease. So make sure you top up with your CoQ10.